it's Jade. So ages and ages ago I was asked to film a product dupe video. High-end products that I've found a dupe for. But this one is a little bit different because all the products that I've found dupes for are products that you can easily find here in Australia. Many kind of beauty gurus out there that are Australian know that we don't get nearly as many brands that they have in America. So many of the products that you see here on YouTube we can't actually get unless we order online. So I've tried to do it just with um, products that you can find here in Australia. So yeah, I hope you guys like this video and let's get started. So we'll start with the lip products. So this product here is Galan's Kiss Kiss Lip Gloss in the colour 841. Beautiful nude lip gloss. It's amazing to wear over the top of the lip lipsticks just to give you some shine and a little bit of colour. But here's the swatch there. Very nude and very natural. So the dupe I've found for that is actually Maybelline's Shiny Licious um, Duos. This is in the colour Half and Half and as you can see it is a very very similar colour. So there's the swatch there. So Sorry, that this light, I don't know what is going on with this light. Um, <laughs> so yeah, as you can see, the colour swatches are very, very similar. The Galan one is probably that little bit shinier, which is why you can see the colour a little bit more, but the very, very similar colours. Okay, so next lip product. Now this isn't necessarily a cheaper dupe, but I get asked every single time I wear this lipstick, where do you get it from? What lipstick is it? Um, and this is a, this is by NYX, which you can't actually get in Australia unless they've changed it, and I just don't know about that. But anyway, I have not seen it in Australia anywhere. Um, but this is NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the colour Addis Ababa. I'll give you guys a swatch, but it's just a very vibrant, hot pink colour. It's kind of a blue-based pink. Super, super pretty. And I've actually found a dupe for this. It's another Maybelline product, um, but it's Maybelline's 140 Fuchsia Fever. And this color is pretty much identical. Um, it is probably slightly lighter, but very, very, very similar. Like when I wear these on my lips, I can't really tell the difference. That's a great dupe if you want to find this a similar product to this one, or if you love that color, try the Maybelline one. It is really, really good. As I said, the price difference, uh, I actually think the NYX is cheaper, but considering you can't get that in Australia, the Maybelline is the right color, so. Next product, I also get asked this all the time, what lipstick are you wearing? So. This is OCC's Lip Tar in the colour Grandma. Um, again, OCC, can't get in Australia in shops or anything. I bought this from eBay. Um, and this is a gorgeous kind of peachy, corally pink shade. Very, very pretty. And I always get lots of compliments when I wear this colour. But the dupe I've found is a lot cheaper. This is Ult Ulta 3, and you can get this in Chemist's um, pharmacies and stuff like that um, and this is in the color orange crush and it is a matte lipstick so I will do a swatch yeah so as you can see there there's that lipstick and there's the OCC lip tar so the colors are very very similar obviously the lipstick will not last you as long as the OCC lip tar because these just go a crazy long way um, but if you do really love that color definitely try that one out because it is so similar moving away from lip products onto the eyes now <laughs> this isn't a very good comparison because I don't have the same color um, you'll, you'll see what I'm talking about in a moment but the texture and the uses I feel are exactly the same and it's a fantastic dupe so I'm talking about Mac Max Paint Pots and Maybelline's color tattoos so as I said these are two completely different colors but the texture and the purpose of them are fantastic. So I use my MAC Paint Pot mainly as a primer. Um, it's a great base tone to really build colour onto and just create a very vibrant look. And that's exactly what I use the Maybelline Colour Tattoo for as well. The texture is very, very similar. I would probably say that the MAC um, Paint Pot is maybe slightly drier. Um, 
but they both really smooth on very very well to the skin and they're both going to last a very very long time so as you can see like that's only a little bit and they're both very very spreadable products and very very pigmented even just on their own so if you guys are looking for a colored primer i definitely try the color tattoos because they're just awesome This is another MAC product. This is a MAC pigment. That is it there. So depending on depending on what you're wanting to use this for, I found an amazing dupe if you just want to get the shimmer and the kind of colour from it. Um, this is just a glitter eyeliner, but it is pretty much in exactly the same colour. This is by Beauty Style and just available from Priceline. And I'll do a swatch. But yeah, if you mainly want to use that product just to get the shimmer and the colour, you can see here, there's the MAC and there is the Beauty Style. But you can see here the colours are very, very similar. This is an eyeshadow by Galan and it's just a smoky kind of um, black and then this kind of silky grey type colour. But they're really nice for doing um, smoky eyes, but it is very, very expensive. So the dupe I found for that is actually Savvy, um, Savvy by Designer Brands, the Smoky Palette Eyeshadow. So I'll show you this. This actually comes with more different colours, but you can still create a very, very sultry, smoky look with this. I'll do a dupe, I'll do a swatch of the both of the colours. The Galan, and then right along here, right next to it, that is the Savvy here. So Savvy, Galan, Savvy, Galan. I don't know if you guys can really tell a difference, but I was just blown away. I was like, why? Why? Why not just buy the cheaper one? And the colours, as I said, are very pigmented. I've had this palette for ages, so yeah. This is the, the closest dupe I've found, and I was blown away. Um, I've actually thrown out my other empty one, so it's unfortunately going to be a bit hard to do a comparison for you guys because I don't have the other thing to compare to but I can tell you what it was like I'll insert a picture when I'm talking about it but the high-end one is Estee Lauder's Ideal Light now this is an under eye concealer it's pretty much a highlighter and you use it to reflect light especially if you have really um, dry skin and like normal cream concealers kind of go a bit cakey and gross this is fantastic to reflect light and just give a beautiful glow to your skin now the dupe that I have found is actually another Maybelline product and it's Maybelline's Lumi Touch highlighter and concealer so the great thing about it is it does exactly the same as the Estee Lauder one but it is so much cheaper the only downside I would say is the bristles are very very scratchy and very kind of harsh on your skin you'd actually need to apply it on your finger and then apply it on your face all right so there you have my high end and low end dupes i hope you guys have enjoyed this video um i'll try and find some more dupes for you guys and i'll make sure i do another video once i've got a good collection of them so yeah i hope you guys like it if you do please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe i'd love your support so have a lovely day and i'll see you guys in my next video bye